God, sink me for this pittance. One thousand reals for those maps. That's what? A hundred pound at most. How's a man supposed to become rich in these times with a miser like Torres running the world? Have you ever, um... You ever worked on a plantation before? You know what I'm thinking? I'd like to see this observatory the governor's going on about. He said it were like a device that could follow people around and show where they were. <laughs> a ludicrous idea. Imagine my wife with such an advantage over me. And imagine what a thing like that would be worth. Sell that to the right person and I'd be the richest pirate privateer in the West Indies. I'll catch you up, Bonnet. There's a sage in that house I must speak to in private. Okay, guys, this is one of the many areas which I have practiced a lot, like played it over and over again to get that perfect synchronization. <laughs>
so waiting is really not my thing and this game really taught me to be swift at some places and be just slow like a sloth at some places and trust me it's worth it because if you won't wait you will have to do the mission all over again so yeah it's good to wait and take your time doing things What is your true name, Rogue? It's a... Uh, <sighs> Captain Pissoff. Bien que pauvre Pizzo. Where is this sage? Did you set him free? I had nothing to do with that. Much as I wish I did. Take him to the ports. Send him to Sevilla with the treasure fleet. Wait up! I delivered your treasures, didn't I? You did, yes. But you robbed us of Duncan Wallow. 